Mehiula Parkway, a major thoroughfare in central Oahu, is getting some attention. The city announced plans to repave 31 lane miles of the parkway and spend nearly $14 million on the project. The community is demanding that this be done, and we're all over the island making our lives easier and better by fixing our roads in our neighborhoods. One city council member says the repaving project is long overdue. The poor road conditions on May Ola Parkway uh, have been the source of uh, considerable frustration uh, for many residents. Uh, I can attest to that fact uh, because I live in Mililani and I drive every day on May Ola Parkway. I also want to point out the fact that Mehuula Parkway is a major roadway in central Oahu that is heavily utilized not only by residents but also by others from across the island to access the Mililani Town Center and its business establishments, the Mililani High School and post office as well. And so in that regard, um, the road repaving that's going to be occurring is definitely badly needed and long overdue. The city says it would have started the repaving project sooner, but it had to figure out how to deal with the roots of monkey pod trees along the parkway. These trees do have a massive root system, and it's not as simple as just cutting a root because a tree could tip over depending on where you cut. And so we had to find arborists, and because there are so many trees, we had to find more than one arborist to advise us on how we cut the roots, where you cut, and then you have to dig the, the, the trench for the new um, curb and the curb is 15 inches yeah, the back high, the, the back of the curb. And it's that way so it goes down far enough so the monkey pod surface roots are forced to go down and then under. But like you said, you, nature, none of us control nature, but I think that putting in these deep curbs and cutting roots are going to make the road last longer. Um, but to make sure it never happens, you'd have to remove the trees. And I don't think anyone in Mililani wants that to happen. So we're finding this balance and that's why it took a while before we actually started digging up the road and repaving, we had to deal with the trees first. Also, the mayor says future repaving projects are going to cost a little more because like Mehiula Parkway, contractor Grace Pacific will have to dig deeper than normal to get the job done. Normally the deaths pertain to the amount of uh, traffic that's on this road. As you can see, this is a heavily used road versus the residential areas where they only have their neighborhood traffic. So basically that's why this road is receiving the nine inches of pavement. That means it takes longer and costs more money, right? but we need to do this. Caldwell says last year, nearly 400 lane miles were paved. And so far this year, 78 lane miles have already been done, which is more than what the city repaved in 2009. Caldwell's goal is to repave 300 lane miles per year over the next five years. And the magic here is that if we do that, every substandard road, of which 43% of our roads are substandard, will be brought up to the best standard. The Mehiula project should be completed by December.